Monday Live. It is Monday night. Almost went all of Monday without doing my my live. And then I gave myself the exception. Time management. Uh, apparently I need to manage my time a little bit better. Or do I? Do you? You know, I know back in the old days, I used to have that day timer. I always had the Covey day timer. That was really cool to have that little notebook full of the little daily pages. And I could sharpen the stone, have that little bookmark, and fill out the bookmark with different things that I wanted to achieve in my life. I don't know if I ever fully used it to the, the, the efficiency level that it wanted me to use it. I don't know if I ever attained the efficiency level that it was supposed to help me attain. Uh, but it was helpful, at least, in helping me keep track of client contacts that I had when I was an outside salesman back then. I even remember spending a ton of money for the Millennium Edition of the Covey Day. Something or other, it had a bunch of cool images on it. And then it had a history of the last hundred years or the last thousand years. I thought it was really cool and I spent the money on it. I haven't used a day timer in a long, long time. I think I've mentioned on here before, mostly what I use now are yellow pads. Yellow pads and a pen, that tends to... I'm not really into time management as much anymore because you could spend so much time on time management... You run out of time, uh, you know, just like those those morning processes that people come up with. It's like, oh, get up, get up really early and, and exercise and meditate and read and write and, and, and do all these things. And by the time you've done all those things, it's like 11 o'clock. Or you're so exhausted from getting up that early that you don't get anything done. I think I digress. I'm trying to focus more on activities. What activities am I able to get done? You know, what can I do in the next 10 minutes? What can I do in the next half an hour? What activity can I do that is the most profitable for me, the most productive? Uh, what activity do I need to get done that, uh, you know, my boss has told me I have to get done or I have to get done in order to make it uh, be done on time for the world. You know, some bill that has to be paid today. Uh, something I have to do for my kids. An appointment I need to get to. You know, we're getting our second vaccines for the kids on Wednesday. Got to make sure I get there. So it's a little bit more activity-based. And if I can make sure that I'm going from activity to activity, then the time management will essentially take care of itself if I just list the activities that I need to handle each day. You know, I was thinking, we always say we don't have enough time for everything. You know, I can't get any everything done, and so sometimes we get nothing done. We don't do anything, or we get fewer things done because we're so overwhelmed by the fact that we have so many things to get done that we don't have time to do it. Well, we might not have time to do everything, but we do have time to do something. And if we do enough some things... Eventually, it may not get to be everything, but if I do, if I look at everything I have to do on Tuesday and I get 75% of it done, and then I get the next 25% of it done on Wednesday, on top of another 50% of what I need to get done on Tuesday, eventually I'll come up with a slow day and I'll be able to catch up. You'll never get everything done because you'll always come up with something else you have to do. But if you stay activity-based and stop thinking about how I can cram everything into this minute time schedule that you have to stick to, 10 to 10.30 is this, and then you do 10.30 to 11 is this, but then you don't even keep track of the fact that you have to do something between 10.30 and 10.35, or you get distracted. See, time management... It's so 90s. Think about the activities that you can do. Think about getting something done now 
and then jumping to the next thing you need to get done. So that is the new time management. Activity management. Give it a try. Tell me how it works for you. Tell me what time management techniques or new techniques altogether that might work for you now in the comments. It's been a great time tonight. We'll see you tomorrow with the win anyway live video podcast.